Hi, I'm Laura, I'm a part of Student Life and I'm also extremely gay, so I thought I'd tell you my top five things to watch if you're a woman who likes women this Pride Month. Number one, Motherland Fort Salem. That show's about an army of gay witches. What more do I need to say? Imagine if during the Salem witch trials, witches were like, hang on, if you don't kill us, we'll fight your wars for you. And that's exactly what happened. The show is filled with some amazing representation, whether you're gay, a woman, or a person of colour. The show is centred around some incredibly strong female characters with almost no male leads. My idea of a perfect show. At its heart is a beautiful queer love story with an amazing lesbian lead who gets to live her life to the fullest and is incredibly strong. It's my go-to show whether I'm feeling sad, happy, or anything in between, and I strongly recommend you watch it. Number two, Crush. Crush is the high school lesbian rom-com we've all been after. There's no coming out story or questioning of anyone's sexuality. They know who they are and they're happy in who they are. And there's a queer love triangle. It's brilliant. It's got all of the tropes, a pining lesbian, the popular girl, and the jock. Seriously, grab some popcorn and it will be the most cheesiest, gayest thing you'll ever watch. And that's why I love it. Number three, Dating Amber. It's Irish gays! The film follows a lesbian and a gay guy as they pretend to be together in order to avoid homophobic comments and actually survive high school. The film is super cute and super gay. It's really, really funny and beautifully shot, with some really heartfelt moments and an ending that will give you hope. Number four, First Kill. Basically gay twilight. The show follows a vampire and a vampire hunter who fall in love. It's really cheesy, it's really corny, the effects are bad, but I love it. The show doesn't take itself too seriously and there are some super sweet lesbian moments in it. It's so refreshing to see two lesbians fully aware of who they are on screen developing love with nobody standing in their way apart from the fact that one's a vampire and one's a vampire hunter. You know, the normal struggles. And finally, number five, My First Summer. The film's about two young girls who discover and learn more about themselves after a sudden and tragic loss. It's beautifully shot and super sweet and I would 100% recommend it. Representation is so important no matter where you are in your coming out experience. Be sure to watch everything I've recommended and check out my article if you're still craving more gay in your life. You can also check out Emily's video which will tell you a few more things you can watch during Pride Month. Be sure to follow all of our social media accounts so you can see this face everywhere and keep up to date with all of the latest student life news. But for now, grab some popcorn, get comfy, happy pride.